hello friends welcome to the power vi tutorial series in this tutorial we will see how we use page navigation in power bi in the previous tutorial we have seen a different type of action method and like uh, how to insert the image and the buttons all these things we have seen and apart from this we have seen one of the action method like web uh, url in the previous tutorial so in this tutorial we will see another action method called page navigation in power bi so let's go to the like a uh, power bi desktop application so here actually what we did we uh, given some action method uh, to these images as a web url we can see like in this action method so we have given uh, these two uh, like action method like uh, web url so for these two images we have done now in this tutorial we will see like there is a another action method called like page navigation so how we use this page navigation in power bi so for that let's uh, what we do we are having all these pages like filter on the visual filter on this page page two page three and now what we will do we will navigate from page one to all these three pages so how we do that navigation in uh, power bi so for that first what we will do in this buttons we will looking one button called blank so let's take that uh, first and i'll take it down and inside uh, this what i will do i will uh, give some formation to this so i will give the um, background color as anything we can give so i have given this background color now inside this text i what i will give i'll take one text so let's take one text and in this text i will write like uh, move to page 2 so that I have written and I will increase the font size as well like 24 in the center and I will make it as a bold so and now what I will do I will keep this text inside this so and what I will do I will make the uh, background color for this also so let's make the background color similar so it will uh, there will not be any difference now similar what i can do uh, i just um, like now similar way i can take a another like a uh, blank and in this also i will um, do the same thing so let's take and do the um, some background color to this also so that background color i have given and i will take one text box and here i will write move to page three so that I have given to this let's resize it so it will be proper for us to visible and make it as a bold and now what I will do I will put it inside the this one and uh, for this also I will make background color as similar so will not see any difference so in this way uh, it is looking now what is our requirement when I click on this like uh, when i click on this blank it should move to the page two and when i click on this move to page three it should move to this page three so we have to assign some action met method to these so what i will do here i will like currently it is off so we have to enable it and once i uh, like on it we can see like currently it is typed back so what i will do i will give the page navigation here so once I click on this page navigation currently destination is none so what we can give here it shows all the pages which we are having in this application so I can select from here page 2 in similar fashion we will do for another also like for this uh, blank also so let's on it then from here need to select page navigation and from here we have to mm, give the page name like on which page you want to navigate and if we want to give we can give the tooltip also if required so as of now i am not giving so live, um, now see when i hover on this it is saying like control click here to follow the link and say similar goes to this so when i click on this control and click we have to do so control and click so when i control and click we are moving to page two so we are coming here so here what i will do let's insert one back button here so let's click on this back button and what will happen i will uh, take this back button here so now if i will click on this it will uh, like control click so it will take us to the previous page 
and similar way we can do for the page 3 also so from here also I will give one back button and control click like we will do we, we back to that uh, like same page so in this way we can utilize like uh, page navigation in power bi tutorial series like you know, there is any requirement like we want like we are making a one dashboard in that dashboard we have some requirement like we want to see some report related to uh, uh, some cells like how uh, that report is working in that table we have given like see more like a particular uh, record we want to see see more so when we click on that see more it should navigate to the another page and it should show the proper detail of that cell sales so in that kind of scenario we utilize this page navigation in power bi uh, desktop application so that's all about this tutorial if you have any question and doubt please comment thank you